ADHD brains are basically looking for a reward that never comes. Amphetamines solve this by providing this reward, turning a super easily distracted scatterbrain into a focused one. In the last decades, ADHD diagnoses in kids and adults in the US have skyrocketed, leading to an unprecedented amount of prescription amphetamines. But amphetamines aren't just drugs, they're tools. Performance enhancing tools perfectly align with our let most me, mainstream. Let me pause, let me, let me see how this is half bullshit, half true. I will draw the shit in 10 seconds and you're, gonna, and you're gonna get it. Like, this is like a normal person. Okay. Let's say some ADHD person. Let's say these two bars are too low. Like, they're like, like this, like that. But they operate about the same, right? On the other ones, right? So, like, like, like then it's about, it's about the same. Yeah. The main problem, the main problem fat. is that is that yeah people say, dude, yeah it's medicine. They have to take the medicine so that so that they're they're they they get this like lack that they don't have. Yeah, I mean I agree with that. I agree with that. It's like glasses for people that don't see properly, right? They put on the glasses. Problem is that glasses don't come with fucking bionic arms, bionic legs. Main problem is that on other systems it'll go like this, it'll go like this, like that, like this. On some of them. It operates on other systems and just the things that, that it's targeting and then it gives them a boost on in, in other categories. It's what it is. That, that's just the basis of it. I am, I'm both a defender and, and against it. I'm more uh, in the middle camp. I see the goods and the bads and I do think that when people say, that they, people simplify and like, oh dude, this is all it does. No, it also does this. I think it's okay to educate people and say, yeah, it does all that. It is what it is.